Stop scrolling, I'm about to blow your mind. Why are there 360 degrees in a circle? It feels so arbitrary. Why not 100? The answer lies in the stars, literally. Ancient civilizations, obsessed with charting the heavens, needed a system. The Babylonians, master calendar makers, based their system on the moon. Their lunar calendar had months of 29 or 30 days to align it with the year. They created an ideal calendar, 12 months of 30 days, 360 days total. This was convenient because their number system was based on 60, 360 fits perfectly. They broke down the day into 12 buru, our hours, then each buru into 30 us, our minutes, 360 us in a day. The sun's rotation, 360 us. See the connection, centuries later. The Greek astronomer Hipparchus adopted this Babylonian system, applying it to geometry, and boom, 360 degrees stuck. But just because it's old doesn't mean it's perfect. Our system is based on ancient astronomical observations. Imagine a world with a more intuitive system. What if angles were simpler to calculate? What if everything was based on something more like a base end system? This isn't just about math. It's about how ancient observations continue to shape the way we understand the world. There's a quote that goes, The cosmos is within us. We are made of star stuff. It serves as a reminder that our understanding is shaped from the past. Ignoring the history of measurement blinds us to new possibilities. We risk being trapped by outdated conventions, limiting our innovative abilities. Like if this made you question reality, subscribe for more mind-bending facts. Unlock your mind. Understand everything.